Thank you once again for visiting the LakeAcone.com Remax website. In our first video, we concentrated primarily on the white set of menus, which were pretty much about us. In this second video, we want to concentrate down here on the red set of menus, and also, as you can see down here, the quick searches, which are available either on the red menus or down here, whichever you prefer, in finding properties on our website. If, let's start here with the red set of menus. If we go across, you can see that we have a drop down once we hit Lake Oconee Lots and Homes. These breakdowns of Lake Oconee Lots and Homes include the following. You could do Lake Homes under 500,000, Lake Homes over 500,000. If you want town homes and condos, we have a selection for that, and also Lake Lots. You'll notice that all of these in the basic lake home, lake lot category are followed by a county selection which will further help you refine your search. All this done, as we said, in one click. We can then move over and look at golf community properties. If we wanted to find golf community lakefront, here we've taken a slightly different approach and actually define these properties by community instead of by county. An example would be Lake Oconee Lakefront Harbor Club Homes. Go ahead and make the selection and you're going to see that we selected Lake Oconee, single family, number of properties is 10. We can then space up and see which properties have automatically been selected by the one-click search. We, well, let's go back home here real quick, just to pull back to the main menu. We've done the same thing on Lake Sinclair, breaking Lake Sinclair, in this case, 300 and under and 300 and over, basically because of the difference in pricing between Lake Sinclair and Lake County. Similar breakdown for land and farms. And then we have a detailed search category, which I will return to shortly. I would prefer right now to just give you a quick overview of what we're doing with foreclosures. We've had a number of requests for foreclosures, as you can understand in today's market. You may be a little bit surprised in the number of foreclosures we have here being less than you would think. But these are the foreclosures. These are current. This comes directly from the Lake Country Board of Realtors MLS. So that when you select that, this is what is available in foreclosures in the area. Now, I'll just select foreclosures residential. And you can see the way that this is organized. It's organized top down, highest price to last. And yes, there are foreclosures and over a million. Um, we did not define these or attempt to define them by type of property. It's really up to you to go ahead and search through. There aren't that many. There's only 40 and you're going to find when you get through the first 10 or 15, that's everything that is near or on Lake Oconee. After that, you're looking at properties that are outside, well, I can't say outside our area, but they will be more residential type of property is not necessarily reflected in this type of a display. Let's go back up here for a minute and we'll go back to the detail search. I do want to explain a few things about the detail search that will help you out. Uh, going across the top headings we have a new search. Ability to just go in and search for anything. We can uh, store favorites, and if we were to find something we like, all you need to do is go ahead and click on the star and save it, and it would be recorded for you um, under your email address. So you would have these and be able to go back to them and bring them with you when you do your actual search out here at the lake. We have a search saver that simply takes the parameters that you use in your search and saves it. It will then notify you via email of any new properties that meet the criterion you set up in Search Saver. Recently viewed properties, pretty self-explanatory. Recent searches, same thing, pretty self-explanatory. A little bit different here, we have some tabs where you could look by subdivision. We could make, do an address 
search if you so desire or search by county and city a lot of folks will call us with a listing number and say what is here is the listing tell me a little bit about this property so we have that right here on the top and listing number this will allow you to find almost anything absolutely in the MLS if you take the time and effort to go ahead and find it in addition to the listing number search you could do by house number street number city zip almost any way somebody could identify a property in the MLS database let's space down here just a little bit if I can and you'll see that we have these breakdowns and here are the total number of properties that match what is in the map selection if I were to try to zero this in to say I only want single family you'll notice that this has dropped to 339 if I wanted to even switch to condos we're going to do a condo search of 39 matches and these are displayed also on the map and if I could get my act together here I'd be able to show you these are the condos that are available on Lake County now by going ahead and highlighting one of these well, no photo available you're going to see that uh, there's a display of the property a little bit of information on it if you were to click on it it's going to give you the total rundown on the property the photos and I think I already explained this photo display to you where we can just click through these quickly and get a nice picture of any property that's available 